catch it! You almost hit me in the pee-pee! Parents fury at NYC's woke Dalton School after first graders are taught about masturbation during sex ed classes that also instruct kids they can't be hugged without consent. Welcome to the Dum Dum News Channel dedicated to reviewing and discussing news stories from around the world. Help me trigger the YouTube algorithm by pressing the thumbs up button, subscribing to my channel, leaving a comment, and sharing with someone you think would like this content. Sources will be linked in the description so you can read the full details yourself. This weekend is Memorial Day weekend, so before I even start the show, I want to say rest in peace to the men and women that died in service for the United States. Yesterday, I did a video about different bizarre stories I found in the news, and I suggest you watch that when you get a chance. Unfortunately, today is no different, but this one is a little more unsettling because the target of the nonsense is first graders. Before I go on a rant, I want to show the video at the center of the controversy. Pass it, Squeaks! Whoa! Watch it! You almost hit me in the pee pee! <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny, you two? He said pee pee. <laughs> <laughs> Do you notice that when you say pee pee, you giggle, but when you say penis, you say it in a serious voice? I never noticed that before. Some children and adults feel uncomfortable when they talk about their private parts, so they make up cute or funny names for them. What's one for a girl's private parts? Vajayjay! <laughs> <laughs> but what does Scoops mean when he says Vajayjay? He means vulva. That's right, Kayla. It's important to use the proper words for our private parts. Why? Because our private parts are just as amazing as our hearts, lungs, brains, or any other of our amazing body parts. But our hearts pump blood, our lungs breathe, and our brains think. All our private parts do is pee. That's not entirely true, Scoops. It is true that a person pees or urinates through a hole called the urethra in the penis. Does everyone have a urethra? They do. It can be harder to see, but girls have a tiny hole in the front of the vulva where urine comes out from their urethra. Urination is actually very important. It helps us get rid of waste, stuff our body doesn't need. Hey, how come my penis gets big sometimes and points up in the air? That's called an erection. Sometimes I touch my penis because it feels good. Sometimes when I'm in my bath or when mom puts me to bed, I like to touch my vulva too. You have a clitoris there, Kayla, that probably feels good to touch the same way Keith's penis feels good when he touches it. But have you ever noticed that older kids and grown-ups don't touch their private parts in public? Hmm, they don't? That's right, Keith. It's okay to touch yourself and see how different body parts feel, but it's best to only do it in private. Well, if private parts are so special, why do you cover them up? Because they are private, silly. That's right, Kayla, because they are private. Hey, Squeaks, pass it. Wait. Okay, I'm ready. My first thoughts are why are they teaching anything about the body or sex to first graders? Do they even know the ABCs at this point? Apparently, this Justine Fonte lady also did a lecture about porn to high school students and from the looks of the slides, it is a mess of confusion and just creates more questions. Aren't high school students at risk for pregnancy? Wouldn't a class to help reduce teen pregnancy be more beneficial at this point? Or maybe a class about STDs? In all seriousness, YouTube does a better job of banning stuff that might be directed at kids. Jeez, I might get a strike for this video. In my opinion, this lady should not only be fired, but also she should not be allowed to teach in any other school district. Yesterday, I came to the conclusion that educators from pre-K all the way to the university finally got 
fed up with their pay and decided to start fighting back against the system by teaching the things that they're teaching now like USA is bad wokeness and now this to little kids in my opinion nothing about sex should be taught to kids let the parents handle that and if the parents need help then give the parents your crazy sex ed classes this nonsense is out of control those are my thoughts what are yours leave them in the comments below please share this video for education and awareness for the dum dum news channel i'm dum dum